there's another way that we can we can combine functions and it's an idea called composite functions what a what a composite function basically is 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 when you can uh, take the result of one function and add that result into another function so let's say for example that I can go down to video only and I have uh, two different uh, ads available to me one ad says that all TVs are three hundred dollars off I see another ad that I had from the week before it said all TVs are 85 percent sorry not are 85 percent off in function notation what that looks like is one discount is its price minus 300 and another one g of x is 0.85x or 85 percent of x so i hope you see how we are able to develop two different functions one each representing a different discount that we have one that's 300 dollars off and one that's written as 85 percent off now imagine that I get in there and I start to haggle with the salesman and I finally get him to say, all right, fine, I'll give you both discounts off at the same time. So what does that look like? Well, that would take my regular function that I have and this would become 85% of X or 0.85 of X minus 300. Both discounts are being claimed within that one function. Now notice this 0.85 of X is also my G of X. So one way to look at this could be F of 0.85 X, the function evaluated 8.5 X is G of X, which is 0.85 X minus 300. And to put that in composite form, I would see this notation where I have F of G of X equals that response. And actually, let's go ahead and take the G of X out and write it this way. There we go. There's the composite function f of g of x equals 0.85 of x minus 300. Both discounts are being used in the exact same overall discount. What this is called is f of g of x. It's a composite function. And how you write a composite function is f circle g of x or f composite with g with g or f with g of x is some of the terminologies that we use when we use a composite function so what do we do with that how does that help us solve our particular problem that we're looking forward with let's look at some examples coming on up